For one Hawaii parent, what started as a way to cope with grief has now become an opportunity to raise awareness about youth suicide. He's now inviting others to join in on the effort. Our Megan Ramones has the story. Hello everyone, uh, my name is Chad Starr. Uh, May 3rd, I will be walking around the perimeter of Oahu for the third time. Chad Starr lost his daughter Sienna to suicide in 2019. She was just 12 years old. To deal with his grief, he started walking and kept walking all the way around Oahu. I knew that I wanted to do something to raise awareness and at, at that time more so just honor Sienna. So far, Chad has walked the perimeter of Oahu two times, all 132 miles of it. He's walked the perimeter of Maui too. Now he's making the trek around Oahu again, and he's hoping others will join him along the way. Chad says the walks allow him to honor Sienna's life. Uh, Sienna uh, was just such a, such a great child, just always laughing, um, super talented. Uh, she was a gymnast, um, very artistic. During his previous walks, hundreds of people joined him along the way. And it just keeps growing larger and larger each year. This year, he's partnering with nonprofit Fight Story, which was created by MMA champ Angela Lee after she lost her younger sister Victoria to suicide last November. It seems to be challenging to find people that want to help others. You know, so when you find someone that, especially someone that's lost someone close to them to suicide, and they want to turn that into something good. I, I appreciate those people because I know how hard it is. He hopes that once parents learn why he's doing the walk, they'll start a conversation with their child about anything they're struggling with. He also hopes more people will be inspired to reach out to a stranger. And I've seen how powerful that is and how, how powerful it can be. Because it can be life-saving. I've had my own struggles, mental health struggles. I've had attempts and I, I just think it's powerful to to see someone that truly cares. The walk is set for May 3rd, and it's not just an ordinary day. Well, so May 3rd is Sienna's birthday. Um, last year, a friend brought some cupcakes and we sang happy birthday to Sienna. So I would love to do that again this year. He's inviting the public to come out, join the walk, and talk story with him. Hope to see you there. Thank you. And you can hear more of our conversation with Star at HawaiiNewsNow.com. And if you or a loved one are struggling, you can reach the National Suicide and Crisis Hotline simply by dialing the numbers 988. Thank you.